Okay, so let's get the app installed for this blind motor. So very straightforward. We'll go for the Smart Life app, or you could use To Your Smart as well. So this is the Google Play Store. If I click there, click open. Now I've already got it installed. If you haven't, obviously install it and create an account on there. Next, we're gonna click on the plus here. Click on small home appliances, scroll down to the bottom and got curtain there. Next, we need to confirm the lights on the actual blind motor are flashing. Okay, so the lights aren't flashing. So what we have to do is just hold on to these two buttons. So the up and the stop button, just for about five seconds, and then they should start flashing. There you go, flashing away now. So now you can click confirm indicator rapidly blink. Okay, so entering your Wi-Fi password, and just to note, this only works on 2.4G Wi-Fi. Let's give it a moment to connect. Okay, so the blind motor's added. Let's okay, click done. So if you look at the curtains, they're closed. If I click the open button, I can pause it as well. Let it carry on to close it. And there you go, stopped, and let's close it now. Okay, so next, let me turn off my Wi-Fi, let the phone go onto 4G, and let me click open again. So it can be controlled remotely even when you're not at home. Okay, to set up on the Amazon Alexa, very straightforward. If you go to the Alexa app, go to skills and games, and search for smart life. Okay, so this is a skill you need, and if you haven't got it enabled, enable it and enter in the credentials you've used for the Smart Life or to your apps. Next, the devices that it's linking to will be discovered. If I go back, go back again, and we wanna go to routines, and then we'll click the plus button up here, and we wanna click when this happens, voice, and we need to enter in open bedroom blind, next to that, and then the action to pick smart home, all devices, and bedroom blind. Okay, next we wanna pick power, and we wanna ensure it's in the on position, click next to that, and then save. Okay, click plus again, click when this happens, click voice, and close bedroom blind. Okay, next to that, okay, the action we want on this, so smart home, all devices, bedroom blind, power, and off on that. Next to that, and save. Okay, so next, if we look in devices, go to all devices, and we can see bedroom blind in there, and there you go, it shows its connectivity. So now, I can say, open bedroom blind. Okay. Close bedroom blind. Okay. Okay, so let's set this up with the Google Home. So very straightforward, if I go to the Home app, click in the corner here, go to settings, go to assistant, home control, click the plus, and the service we wanna look for is Smart Life. So if you haven't got it, add it in. Once you've added it in, it'll ask for your credentials, enter your credentials in, and then it will link with Google Home. Okay, so once the service is linked in, if I have a look through the devices I have, I'll see bedroom blind. If I click on that, no options available. Okay, so now I can say, Open bedroom blind. Okay, opening the bedroom blind. Close bedroom blind. Sure, closing the bedroom blind. 